This pond is filthy and this is not a healthy condition for these fish. This is so gross. Oh, oh, back there under the cave. Oh, I got him. That is freaking insane. That was something big. It was huge. It's an Oscar, Helen. It's a big Oscar. Ew. Look at his eyes. I don't know if that's normal, guys. Oh, there's something in it. It's a little albino placo. Whoa. I got the big fish. I got the big one. Oh, it's moving. Look, look how many there are. That's a freaking koi, you guys. Oh my gosh, he's huge. I think there's something big. Ew, look at this algae. What the heck is that? Oh my God, it's albino. No, no freaking way! Oh. Oh. We got one! Ready? Look at that. What is up, VFP Nation? Welcome back to another awesome video, guys. Today, we're gonna be saying fish from this filthy abandoned pond. You guys might recognize this spot, and that's because we filmed a couple videos here before. If you guys haven't seen those, basically, this little tiny pond was filled with abandoned fish, and we came here and we tried to save as many as possible. And I thought we succeeded in the mission, guys. I really thought we saved all the fish up until a couple days ago when I came here to check it out, and I saw a ton of fish still living in here. And I was a little confused after seeing that because if you remember in the second video, we actually drained the pond. So I had no idea how there were still fishing here and then i remembered that there was so much mud in there it was actually impossible to get all the water out so a lot of these fish could have been hiding in the mud and we would have never seen them so after i saw that there was still fish in here i decided we had to come back and make another video saving them out of here because as you can see this pond is filthy and this is not a healthy condition for these fish so it's really important that we try our best to catch the rest out today but not only are we going to be saving more fish out of this abandoned pond we're going to be going back to multiple abandoned locations where we saved fish from in the past because after seeing that there was more fish still in this one i have a feeling that a lot of these other abandoned spots still have fish in it so we're gonna net around in this one see what else we can catch in it and then we're gonna head to the abandoned fountain that was where those giant arowanas were then guys we're gonna go back to the og abandoned ponds the spot we made a ton of videos at and we caught so many fish out and saved them the reason we stopped going there is because they actually began construction and i thought it was all gone however i got word that there's still one more pond that's still there and we're gonna go back there today and try to set some traps and hopefully save some more fish out of it guys so i'm really excited to see what all we can pull out of this pond today because last time it was loaded with fish so guys i got my net right here we got some buckets i'm gonna get in there start netting around and see if we can pull out any more fish here we go now guys like i said i was here a couple days ago and i saw a lot of fish i did see some goldfish however there was some other stuff i don't know where they are right now because as you can see there's so much algae in here i mean look how disgusting this stuff is and there's fish in here this is so gross oh my god oh that is so nasty well i think the only way to do this is just to take some random nets but first we gotta fill up this bucket right here so if we do catch any fish, we could bring them home. I don't even know how we're going to do this without getting this nasty algae in there. <laughs> Ew, oh, oh, no. Oh, it's over. Oh, my God. Okay, well, that's so gross. Well, there's our bucket, guys. I'm going to step in here, and I'm going to start netting around. Oh, this is so nasty. At least I got my boots on. Here we go. First net, guys. Just like this. Oh, my God. It's going to be so hard to go through this. Look at all that algae. Ew. Oh, 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 it smells so bad. This is like fish poop and algae mixed together. I don't think we... Oh, we got a pencil. I don't think we got any fish in the first net, guys. Oh, oh, back there under the cave. Look, you see those? Those are big goldfish, I think. There's a bunch back there. I, I literally see like five right now. I got to sneak attack them. Here we go. Ew, my hand touched it. Oh, I got him. Yes, massive goldfish. Check this out. Look at the size of that guy. They're huge, you guys. Last time we caught these little baby goldfish, and I'm pretty sure those were just feeder fish for the bigger stuff in here. And I think that's what these guys are. They got a lot bigger. Look at that. Oh my goodness. Look at that. These are just common little goldfish. There's two. Oh, look, there's one poking out of the algae right there. All right, we got three in one net. Oh my gosh. Oh, there's four. <laughs> this one's freaking huge. Look how fat they are. There's oh, another one. Oh my gosh. Look at this, you guys. We just caught five massive goldfish in one net we're gonna add them to the I, bucket i think there's another one look oh my god there is look at you oh my gosh he was hiding that was an insane second scoop as i said guys there was a lot of fish in here and that proves it so we're gonna get them in the bucket and then we're gonna net around some more and see what else we could find oh oh look right there there's a white one wait is that a goldfish that could be something else it's white did I get him? Oh, I don't know if I got him, guys. This mud is so thick. I don't think we got him. We'll make sure. Oh, this is so disgusting. I should have brought gloves. You know, that would have been a smart thing to do. 
Let's take a little random net right here. Oh, there's bubbles. That means there's a fish right here. Come on. Ew. Oh, it's so thick. This is the nastiest stuff I've ever seen. Oh my gosh. Oh my, oh, it smells. Oh, look right there, look right there. That's not a goldfish, that's something different. What the heck is that? Oh my, oh, it's a little molly. Beautiful, look at that, guys. That is a molly, an orange and white one. Another nice little aquarium fish we're gonna add to the bucket. There he goes. Right here, there's a big fish, big fish. You see that? Got it. There's something big moving around down there. Hopefully we caught that. I don't know what it was. I couldn't tell. It was pretty big. Oh, this is so oh my gosh. No way. Is that an angel fish? It is. You guys, look how cool that is. We caught an angel fish. That's a big one. We caught these here last time. I think there was a breeding pair. There was babies. There was big ones. But that is really cool, guys. Nice little angel fish. We're going to add them to the bucket. Third species already out of the abandoned pond. There's a lot more fish than I thought there was, guys. It's almost every net we're catching something. So let's get back in there. Try to catch some more. Oh, this is so... Oh! Helen, what was that? There was something big right here. It was moving. Oh my God, it's gone. What the heck was that? Okay, that was something big. It was huge. It hit my foot and then it just disappeared. Oh my gosh. Okay, hopefully we find out what that is. Could be a turtle. I don't know. Oh my gosh. Look right there. There's so many goldfish in this corner. Look, can you see them? There's like five right there. I'm gonna try and net them. Here we go. Oh yes. Oh my gosh. There's so many. Look at this. This is more than the other net. Look at that. Holy crap, there's so many. Look at this, you guys. This one's pretty. This one's like white and orange. This is freaking nuts, guys. They're so fat in here, too. They're probably eating all this algae. Look at that. There's four. Oh, my gosh. Look right there. That is an albino red Oscar. We caught these last time. That is so cool. I think we caught two out of here last time. And that looks like the same type of Oscar. So that's really cool. I don't know. Maybe there was like a breeding pair and these were the babies. I guess we got two more goldfish. What a freaking net. All right, let's get these guys in the bucket. I had no idea there was this many fish left in here, but that is freaking insane. All right, there they go. We're going to add them to the bucket. Look how many fish we got already, guys. We've been here for five minutes. Okay, I got to get back in there, guys. I see a lot more fish. Look at this. There's garbage everywhere here too this is what i'm talking about this is not a healthy environment for any fish there's bottles everywhere there's bags i mean look at that oh oh my god helen there's something in it there's something in this bag oh please tell me we got it guys check this out i swear there was a fish in there Ugh. oh my there he is there he is he went into the algae guys he was inside of that bag that's why you don't litter guys there was a fish stuck in there another angel fish this one is different though it's white and orange that's really cool so that's two angel fish out of here already a black one and then a white and gold that is super cool we're gonna add them to the bucket now we gotta go through all this trash in here make sure there's no more fish trapped in it because that fish could have easily died in here that is horrible snake attack oh this stuff is so nasty it smells horrible oh there's gotta be something in this one look at all that oh my gosh did we get anything oh there's a fish there's a fish right here oh, oh yes 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 that's a clown loach guys check this out oh my gosh he's huge we caught some of these last time and ow 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 oh my god look at the spine on his freaking face that just went inside of my hand this is called a clown loach guys they're really cool fish and like i said we caught some here last time they were a lot smaller though it looks like they grew that is so cool guys check it out we got our little viewing container filled up we're gonna add them into it this is such a cool fish look at the colors on that guy he's big too what an insane find maybe there's more in here they are a schooling fish okay buddy there you go go into the bucket oh look there's a bunch more goldfish back here oh there's a fish right there oh, oh it's, it's an oscar helen it's a big oscar really yes come on buddy get in it yes it's another albino red oscar look at that good eye helen oh that one is so much bigger than the other one we just caught oh relax that is so crazy we just caught a baby and now we've caught the adult that is definitely the same type of oscar right there but this guy's a lot smaller than this one Oh no, 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 no. Where did he go? Does he not want to be saved? Like what's going on? Oh, there he is. Get back in the net. <laughs> we got him. All right, let's get him into the bucket before he escapes again. That's so cool, guys. A really pretty Oscar. We're going to add him to the bucket. Maybe my theory was, right guys, we've caught babies and now we just caught an adult one. Oh, this is like the hot pot worm. Oh yes, I got one for sure. Ugh, here we go. Oh, it smells so bad. Right there, right there. Another big chunky goldfish. Oh, what is that? What is that? There's something moving right here under the algae. Oh my God. Look at that. That's a white goldfish. Oh my, Helen, look. Is that another angelfish? I think it is. Yes. Oh, this one is freaking gorgeous. Look at the long fins on it. Okay, we got three fish in that net, including another angelfish. That is crazy. Look how long his fins are. That is beautiful. We got that guy, and then we got two more goldfish going in. Wait, zoom in back there. Do you see that? There is a massive fish. Holy crap. It's literally, it's this big. No freaking way. What the heck was that? Where the heck did it go? You guys, I just spotted a massive fish, guys. I hit it with my foot earlier, and I just saw 
it was under that corner right there. It was moving around. Oh, look right here, right under me. There's a little fish, little orange fish. Where'd he go? I think we got him. Oh, there he is. Look, a little baby goldfish. Look at this little guy. Look how fat he is. Oh my, ew, oh, ew. Look at his eyes. You see that? What is wrong with him? Oh my gosh. Ew, it's like face is all puffed up. Ew. What is that? Is that normal? I've never seen anything like that. What the heck? His eyes are so funny looking. I don't know if that's normal, guys. Comment down below why his eyes are like that. But he's pretty cute. We're going to add him to the bucket and keep going. All right, guys, now check this out. Right under this box is where we caught a breeding pair of angelfish last time. I'm going to lift it up and scoop under it. We'll see if anything's in there this time. Here we go. Oh, yeah. Let's dump it out. Ew. Oh, oh, there's something in it. Check this out. I think we got it. Guys, there's no way it escaped. Oh, right down there. I see color. What is it? Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. That's a breeding pair, baby. That's got to be a breeding pair. They were in that box together. That is so cool. That's what, like four angelfish out of here already? Anyone else? Ugh. Oh, oh, my God. Helen, that's a freaking baby. No way. You guys, look at that. We've just caught a breeding pair of angelfish and one of their babies. I freaking knew it. I knew they had to be breeding. That is so cool, guys. Let's get them in the bucket. That right there means there's got to be a lot more in here if they're breeding. We're going to add them to the bucket and we're going to keep going, guys. Over right here, right here, right by my foot. I just felt the big fish again. Just felt it. Where did it go? Ew. Look at that. That is why it's impossible to catch out every fish here. There's just too much mud. <laughs> Oh yeah, that was a good net. Oh, it's so heavy. Oh my God, look at that. Let's see, what do we get? Oh, I see color. What was that? I thought I saw something, guys. I saw some color in there. Oh, right there. Oh my gosh. Is that another Oscar? Look at that. Another little baby super red Oscar. That is insane. Oh my, there's another one. Look at that. They just keep coming. That is a total of three babies and a big one. They are everywhere. That is so freaking cool, guys. As you know, Oscars are one of my favorite fish. And these are really nice ones. And I think that's it for that net. Let's get these guys in the bucket. We're going to do a few more nets, guys. We do want to hit some other locations today, so we can't spend all day here. But we're going to do a few more nets here, try to save some more fish, and then head to the other spots. Here we go. Hold on a second. Helen. Oh, oh my God. No freaking way, there's something else in here. Check this out. Look in there. Do you see that? Look at that thing. It's a little albino placo. Oh my. Whoa. Look at its fins. They're super long. Oh, it's a bristle nose. Check that out. Look how cool that albino placo is. He was in that box where the angelfish were. There could be more in there too. I've never seen anything like this, guys. Check this out. Look how long its fins are. That is so cool, you guys. That is like the prettiest placo I think I've ever seen. Well, that's really cool, guys. That just shows how easy it is to miss fish in here. With all this mud, it's really hard to tell. I mean, we already checked that box. We caught the angelfish out. And this guy was still in there just hiding out. So we're going to go ahead and add him to the bucket and keep going. That is a super cool fish, guys. What a cool find. Oh, right here. Right here. Look, there's another little baby goldfish. I think I got him. And there's another trash bag. Let's take that out, too. See if there's anything in there. Oh, God. There was like a little tiny orange fish in there. Oh, right here. Oh, my God. Yes. Another clown loach. Look at that. This one's a little smaller. That is so cool. Buddy, relax. We're trying to save you. Look at that little guy. God, these fish are so pretty. That's the second one we caught today. Today. Where did the goldfish go? I thought there was a goldfish. It's another one with those weird gooey eyes. Oh, that's so disgusting. <laughs> All right, let's add them to the bucket, guys. Look at this haul we got. We got handfuls of fish out of here already. Oh my gosh. I didn't even realize we caught that many. Look at that. That is insane. Okay. I guess this might call for like a part four, guys. If you want me to come back here again, try to catch some more fish out, just let me know. I'll take a few more scoops and see if we can catch any more fish. And then we're going to head to the next spot, guys. I'm really excited. After catching all these fish out of here, who knows what is left in the other ones? Oh, look right there. Big goldfish. Come on, buddy. Oh, it's your last chance. Big scoop. Let's see. Oh, 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 I got the big fish. I got the big one. Look right there. Ew. What the heck is... Ew. It's so slimy. What is this thing? Oh, my gosh. Oh, oh, it's moving. Helen, is that a lungfish? No way. <gasps> it's a lungfish, dude. Look at him. It's a massive lungfish, you guys. No freaking way. Oh, that is so cool, you guys. Look how big he is. He's massive. That right there, you guys, is a freaking lungfish. I think that's the big one that I've been seeing. That is our third lungfish that we have now. We got Slippy. We got Sloppy. What should we name this guy? Like Slurpy? Yeah. Slurpy? Okay. I was not expecting to catch a lungfish. But like I said, guys, a lot of these fish could have survived in the mud when we drained it. And these guys are actually known for surviving months in Africa by covering themselves in mud. They can literally live out of water for months at a time. Oh my gosh, she's going crazy. Okay. Oh my gosh. Wow. That is such a crazy fish. We actually just caught one out of a different spot. It was like this big. Look at his little arms. They are so cool and very slimy. So I'm going to get him back in the bucket before I drop him. There you go, buddy. All right, we're going to take that guy home. So what we're going to do, guys, we're going to head back to my house and get all the fish that we saved out of this abandoned pond into my ponds. And then we're going to go to the abandoned fountain and see what we can catch out of that. And yeah, guys, this is a very successful day so far we'll see you guys back at my house
All right, you guys, we've made it back to my house and we're starting things off here at the fish room. Now it's not complete, not yet guys, but we're getting there. As you can see, we're starting to fill up the shelves with fish tanks. Now, as you can see, this is gonna be the shelf with all the bigger fish tanks. Soon, all four fish tanks are gonna be this size. And right now guys, we're gonna add the monster lungfish we just caught into this fish tank. This is gonna be the first fish in there. And yeah, it's gonna be really cool. I cannot wait till all this is done. We're gonna have so many fish in here. It's gonna be insane. All right, where is he? We got so many fish in here. Here he is. Oh my gosh, look how cool that is. That Slurpee, the lungfish. And we're gonna add him to the fish tank. There he goes. Look how cool he is. Oh, oh my gosh, he's massive. Now we have a small one. We got the massive one. And now we have a medium one. That is so cool, guys. We got these little tiny super red Oscars. And we're gonna go ahead and add them to the little grow out tank. We've got some really cool mini monsters in here growing out. And these guys are gonna go perfect in here. There they go, all three of them. So cool. We're also gonna get these little clown loaches in here as well. Look how cool those fish are. Sweet. Oh, look, they're meeting the puffer. Oh! Um, that puffer fish just, oh, oh, don't do it. Don't you dare. Do it again and see what happens. Oh, oh, okay. You know what? Let's move that puffer fish. He's a little bully. I had no idea he was so aggressive. Oh yeah, that's right. We got him. All right. We don't know where we're going to put him yet. You know what? Let's put him with a big long fish. I doubt he's going to mess with that guy. Little puffer fish going in. There he goes. Now he's in here with Slurpee. Hopefully he won't mess with him. And now we got the rest of the fish that we saved today in this bucket. We're going to add them to the ponds and tanks around my backyard. Here we go. And now guys, we're here at the mini pond. We've been adding a lot of fish in here recently. And right here in my hand, we got some more we're going to add to it. We got these little bubble eye goldfish. I I don't know what they're called but they look cool got a little baby angelfish and then a molly all really cool colorful fish and they'll go great into this pond there they go and right here guys we got the adult angelfish what's that five in total that is so cool we're gonna go ahead and get them into the mini pond and they're gonna go great in here there they go and lastly for this pond guys we're gonna add this really cool long fin albino placo he's gonna look great in there there he goes look how pretty and now guys i think the majority of the fish that we saved today was actually goldfish and as you can see we got a whole net full of them right now this is actually going to be perfect food for the Mata Mata and the giant lungfish. So we're going to go ahead and get these guys into this pond. There they go. Oh my gosh, there's so many. And check it out, guys. For the bigger red Oscar, we're going to add it to the Oscar army. So there he goes. Beautiful Oscar. And now that we've added all the fish into the ponds and tanks from the first spot, we're going to head to the second spot, guys. The abandoned fountain. And then we're going to head to the other abandoned ponds and play some fish traps. Here we go, guys. All right, you guys, we've made it to the second spot, the abandoned fountain. And as you can tell, guys, it's really overgrown now. It's been a few months. So we gotta trek through the jungle to get over there. All right, here we go. <gasps> look, there's ripples in the water. Oh my God, there's a lot of ripples. You guys, I see fish in here. I can't tell what they are though. They look really small. Oh my gosh, it's so overgrown. Look at all these branches. Oh, there's a little, <gasps> there's a fancy guppy right there. No way, you guys, there's still fish in here. That is so crazy. I'm gonna fill up a bucket and I guess we're gonna get to netting and see what we can catch. Here we go. Oh, look right there, look right there. There's a bunch of fish. Oh yes, oh my God. There's so many, check it out. They're really tiny though. Oh <gasps> Yes, we got them. These are little blue wag platties. Look at the colors on those fish. Anyone else in here? That is insane. Just the first scoop, you guys. We're going to get these guys in the bucket and then keep going. There's a freaking trillion right there. You see them? Oh my God. That's the most I've ever seen here. Look at that. Holy crap. There's so many. They're breeding like crazy in here. That's got to be what's happening. That is freaking crazy. Look at the colors on this one. Oh my gosh. They're so pretty. Look how many we got in the second scoop, you guys. This is so cool. You got babies. You got adults. Oh, there's some. Look, look right there. There's some really colorful ones. I really wish I could place a fish trap in here, but I only brought one fish trap and I saved that for the next spot. I guess it doesn't really matter because I mean, look at all the ones we're catching with the net. This is so insane. Insane. This is the most we've ever seen here. I think just catching all the predators out, you know, because there was arowanas in here, some really cool fish. So us taking the arowanas out, all those kinds of fish, it eliminates all the predators. So these little guys could breed like crazy. And now there's like thousands. Oh my goodness. Look how many we have already. That's only three nets worth. All right, let's keep going and uh, see what else we can catch. So let's take another scoop. Here we go. Oh yeah. Oh my gosh. Look at that. There's so many. There's red ones. There's blue ones. What the heck is this? Whoa, that's like some sort of tetra or something. We're just going to keep going. Keep adding them to the bucket. We're not going to save the tadpoles. They don't need saving. Once they turn into frogs, they could just hop out of here. Oh, that's a big one. Oh my God. Wait, what is that? Oh, no way. Gosh, I... 
You hear that? Sounded like something inside of the abandoned house. Look at this though. We just caught, I think, yeah, that's a freaking koi, you guys. We caught koi out of here last time, but judging by how small he is, I think this guy was probably about this big when we were last here. Look how cool that is. Beautiful koi. We're gonna add to the bucket. And once again, just thousands and thousands of platies. Oh, right there. Look, look how many there are. Ew, look at this algae. Oh, that is so, oh my, oh, it just keeps going. We got a lot in that net. Look at that. Look how giant this platy is. <gasps> More of these little tetras. Guys, comment down below what these are called. Some sort of tetra for sure. There he goes. Oh my God. Look at that one. It's huge. We're catching a lot of these too. They're, they're little like alien things. Ew. Comment down below what that is, you guys. They're everywhere in here. Oh, look at this guy. He's covered in the algae. It looks like another tetra. Oh, that is, that is another tetra. There you go goes in the bucket that's our third one i'm gonna net under this big pile of branches there could be some fish hiding under there oh yeah oh yes an angel fish look at that another big angel fish guys we caught a lot out of the first spot and now we got another one out of this pond the first few videos here we did catch some angel fish maybe they're breeding here as well that's crazy let's add them to the bucket there he goes what else we got oh lots of algae and in the mix his little fish hiding in there whoa, whoa, whoa look right there you see that you see the water moving that was a bigger fish that was not a platy I I think there's something big oh what the heck whoa something big is in here you guys oh look at this there's a little placo in here oh he's pretty that is not a normal one look he's got the little bristle nose look at that he's all black with some really pretty white dots i think the thing i saw was a lot bigger than this guy i was just hoping to find like a couple little platies and mollies and here we are there's thousands in here and along with those some really cool fish look at that bucket look how many freaking fish we have in there already we're gonna add the placo in there he goes let's keep going and see what else we can fine it's slowing down a little bit we're still catching little fish but you know what i think they're all hiding under those branches right there because we haven't been there yet so i think i'm gonna sneak my way over there and try to get a net in i think that's where they all are oh yeah oh yeah there's a lot okay there we go oh that was perfect oh my gosh oh there's so many fish in here oh whoa what the, helen what the heck is that oh my god it's albino is that a bicer we caught ours i think that's an albino bicer that is insane he's so adorable okay we're gonna get him in the bucket like i said there's so many fish in here oh another tetra nice another little baby tetra get him in the bucket what else do we got oh my Dude, I was washing the algae out. Look at this. Oh, it's a massive garami. Look at that giant blue garami, you guys. Oh my God. Get him in the bucket. This is insane, you guys. We're catching so many fish out of here. Oh, there's a lot right there. Oh yeah, we got him. Oh, what is that? Oh, look. We got a little frog in there. What are you doing? Oh my God. Oh my God. What is with the fish and frogs and everything just going after you? They love attacking you. Okay, guys, as scary as it is, I think I'm going to step in here and make it a lot easier because I think all the fish are in this middle part right now. They know we're here and they're hiding. Oh, right here. Right here. Yes. There were so many fish right there. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Big fish. What are you? Oh, yeah. Another gourami. That's a gold one, though. Beautiful. We'll add him to the bucket. <gasps> Whoa. That's a fish. It's moving. Oh, my God. Check that out, guys. That's some sort of knife fish. Oh, my gosh. It's huge. I think that's called a ghost knife fish. That is really cool. I don't think we've caught one of these out of here. So that is a first, but that is super cool. What an insane catch. Look at that thing. Now guys, like I said, there's one more spot after this one, the OG abandoned ponds. I'm super excited. And we gotta hurry up and try to save all those fish before they destroy it. So we're gonna do a few more nets here and then we're gonna head to the next spot. Here we go. Whoa, check this out. There's a big fish in here. Oh, oh my God. That is the biggest one yet. Look at that. That is a massive pregnant platy. There you go. All right, last net, guys. I think we're going to have to come back here again because there's so many fish. But, oh, yeah, look at that. Last net, we got so many more fish. Oh, my gosh, they just keep coming. Okay, we're going to sort through these, get them in the bucket, and then head to the next spot, guys. The amount of fish that we have just saved out of this little fountain right now is just insane. Look at this. Look at the hole. We got little placos. We got koi. We got angelfish, gouramis, albino bicers, some really cool knife fish, and literally hundreds of these little platies. I mean, that is so cool. So what we're going to do, guys, like I said, there's one more spot after this. We're going to head there right now, throw a fish trap in, and leave it overnight. And then we're going to get all the fish, bring them back to my house, and put them into the backyard ponds. This was crazy, guys. The amount of fish we've caught already is insane, and hopefully we can catch some more. Here we go. All right, you guys, and we've made it to the third and final spot of the day. And this right here is the OG abandoned pond spot, guys. You probably don't recognize it right now because it is a total freaking wasteland. They've completely destroyed the 
whole entire thing. You guys definitely have seen some videos here. We caught so many fish and saved them because we knew this was going to happen. I mean, look at this. They filled in all the ponds. They've cut down all the trees and all that is left right now is this one little pond. I don't remember which one this is. I can't even tell. But as you can see, they're slowly filling this one in as well. So what we're going to do, guys, we got a little fish trap right here and we're going to place it in here one last time to try and catch out some more fish before it's too late, guys. So right here, guys, we got a tilapia fillet. We're going to set it in the trap and we're going to drop it in this pond. This is super sad, guys. I mean, thinking about all the videos that we made here, all the fish that we saved, it was crazy. And uh, yeah, it's come to an end. So guys, we're going to place the final fish trap at the abandoned ponds. I guess we'll throw it right there. Okay, that works. The construction people are working here like every day. So that's why we can't come here. But today it's Sunday. They're not working. So what we're going to do, we're going to leave this overnight. We're going to come back, check the fish trap, and hopefully we call something crazy. And yeah, guys, we'll see you then. All right, you guys, it is a few hours later and it is the middle of the night. Now look at that, guys. It actually looked like the trap moved a little bit because when we placed it, a little bit was sticking out of the water. So it looks like something dragged it down a little bit. Oh, this water is disgusting. Here we go. Oh my gosh, please. I'm really hoping there's still fish in here. I'm hoping there's fish in here and I'm also hoping there's not. But here we go, guys. Let's see what we caught. Oh my God. You guys, look at this. The trap is really heavy. We actually caught a lot of fish in here. No freaking way. Oscars. Look at this Oscar. Oh, that is beautiful. I think that's a little lemon Oscar. Look, there's another one too. This one's massive. This one looks like it's short bodied. Look at that. That looks like a little short body Oscar. We've caught one of these here before. That's really cool. What else we got? Oh my gosh. Look at that. A massive electric blue Acara. Okay, we gotta go quick. There's so many fish. Look at that. We got a little Jaguar cichlid. That's cool. No way. What kind of eels are these? Oh, I can't get them. Guys, there's little eels in there. Look at that. That right there is a native species. That's called a warmouth. We'll save him. Look at that. We even got a little baby Oscar. African cichlid. Another warmouth. The amount of fish in here is insane. Oh my gosh. We've caught a lot of these here before. These are called venistas. More African cichlids. I got one. Look at that. Is that a tire track eel or a fire eel? I can't tell. There's a couple of them in here. Look at this. There's the second one. Oh, dude, they're fire reels. Look, there's the orange right there. These are little baby fire reels. Oh my gosh, that's so adorable. Oh my God. A baby pike cichlid. That is insane. Ew. Oh my. Wait, what is this? It's a turtle. Oh my gosh, look. It's a little soft shell. He looks just like my albino one. Guys, that right there is a Florida soft shell turtle. Are you mean? Look, he's nice. Why can't our albino one be this nice? Look how gentle he is. However, guys, we cannot keep this guy. That would be illegal. So honestly, I'm not sure what we're gonna do. Thing with these guys, they don't need water. They could walk on land. So hopefully this guy just finds another pond when they fill this one in. So hopefully he'll be good, but we gotta let him go. See you, buddy. There he goes. Well, guys, the abandoned pond is still loaded with fish. It's really sad, but you know what? There's not much we could do. Soon they're gonna fill this all in. But check this out. We caught a lot today. And yeah, this was a pretty good haul. So what we're gonna do, guys, we're gonna bring all the fish from this spot and the other spot back to my house and we're gonna put them in the backyard ponds and the fish tanks so we'll see you guys there all right you guys we've made it back to my house and we've got the rest of the fish we're gonna add to the backyard ponds we're here at the mystery pond and in this pond we're gonna add this really cool knife fish this albino bicher and this little baby koi here they go check out this knife fish they're so cool the way they swim backwards <laughs> there he goes and right here guys we got two albino oscars a lemon and then a normal albino and we're gonna add them to the oscar army there goes the lemon and then there goes i think a short body albino oscar look at that oh my gosh look there's one of the little red tails there's all the oscars and we're back at the mini pond adding more angel fish to the bunch there goes another big boy there he goes and in this net we got a bunch of these little mystery tetras and we're gonna add them to the mini pond there they go and right here guys we got a mixture of a bunch of different cichlids including this guy a little pike cichlid we're gonna go ahead and add them to the cichlid pond here they go see you guys all right guys and now we're here at the crawfish jungle gym we've been adding little baby eels in here for a long time and right now we got two little baby fire eels we're gonna add them to it there he goes guys look how many guppies there are and there goes the second one. They're just little babies. Now guys, I forgot about this guy, the really cool Placo. But other than this guy, all that's left is the little tiny platies and the mollies. And right now we're gonna dump them all in this net and then get them to the Mata Mata Turtle Pond. Look at this. Look how many there are. For all these guys, we're gonna add them to this pond and they're gonna breed like crazy. There they go. And this guy, we're gonna add to the fish tank in the fish room. There he goes. Oh, look at him. There he goes. Oh, we <laughs> went the wrong way. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh, here he comes through his little cave. Come on, fatty, squeeze through. Why he's so <laughs> slow? <laughs> <laughs> what is that? <laughs> oh, 
we got it. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh Jesus. Took them long enough. It took the gulper catfish like 10 times to try and get that goldfish. Oh my gosh. Look at his belly. Well guys, I just realized as we filmed this video, we hit a million subscribers on the channel. I literally don't even know what to say guys. That is mind blowing. Thank you so much. I cannot believe this is happening. I mean, when I first started making these videos, there was no expectations. I never thought this would be possible. And thanks to you guys, it is. I am so grateful. So thank you so much guys. A million members of the BFP Nation. That is freaking insane. This is so insane guys. And I couldn't have done it without you, each and every one of you. Thank you so much guys. If you did enjoy this video, please go down there and leave a like, subscribe down below. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.